The Morse Museum was founded in 1989 and first opened to the public in this facility in 1992. At the time of its founding, it was the first and only museum in the country devoted to the art of the American South. It's a collection of, of about 5,000 objects of all kinds, paintings, works on paper, prints, drawings, photographs, uh, and some sculpture, representing the visual culture of the South from the late colonial era to the present. And so uh, as that is the broadest based representative collection of Southern imagery in an American museum. Just the variety of Southern artists that's um, here is amazing. It's got sculptures, photography, paintings, pretty much anything you want to see in an art museum. My favorite thing about the museum is their Sunday program for kids. Uh, they have Toddler Thursdays, they have art activities on Sundays, and musical entertainment for the children, so it's really been beneficial for families with small children. Everything in this museum tells a story, and so all of these paintings uh, imply the story of the person who sat for them. But then there are all these stories that are implied by the paintings themselves, not just the, the background that you don't see, but within the frame of the picture. The Morris is unique because our collection is dedicated to the art and artist of the American South. And we are the first museum um, to, to have such a wonderful, wonderful collection. We have more than 5,000 works of art. It really is a jewel of Augusta, the um, CSRA, and the region. When you talk about a museum, you think boring, stuffy, but when you are here, you'll be totally surprised.